Hello and welcome to this tutorial from Barrington Tutorials. Uh, today we're going to make a muzzle flash in Adobe After Effects. And uh, the effect is going to look like this. I hope you can see it. Um, we got some uh, nice big muzzle flash and uh, some smoke. Um, if you can see it here in this area. And this uh, muzzle flash is uh, made. Uh, I made it. And uh, you can download it uh, in the link in the description of this channel. You can download the whole folder with um, a couple of different uh, muzzle flashes I made uh, in Photoshop and After Effects. There is 10 muzzle flashes if I'm right. Uh, so uh, this is kind of uh, a kind of uh, awesome package, whatever you want to call it. Um, so you can download this for free. Um, okay, so anyway, here we are inside After Effects, and we're going to make the effect. So it's actually pretty simple. Uh, I'm just going to delete this muzzle flashes and the glow. So now it's just my video where I'm pretending shooting my gun. So right here, when we're going to shoot, we're going to import our muzzle flash flash side um put it where you where, wherever you want it set the transfer mode you can talk about it between the transfer mode and the 3d modes and settings here by uh, uh, pressing the f4 button uh, or press toggle switches here but set the transfer mode to um, f sorry and scale it down maybe move it over the over the adjustment layer yeah and just place it then we will take the footage again duplicate it um, set it to lighten and we want to make a fast color correction you go to curves so I do it like this take the red channel up a little bit like that and then we want to mask out the areas that will get affected by the light so we're going to mask my hands here and the gun like that so um, we press F for feather just yeah and just feather this whatever you how, how much you want to so that looks good then press T for the opacity set a keyframe when the muzzle flash is at 100% go one frame back set it to zero and go one frame after the muzzle flash and set it to zero. So now it's just like a flash and in the muzzle flashes there is sound effects so you don't have to to uh, think about that um, but this is a clock sound so if you're shooting a mp5 or something you can t just take the sound off and import your, uh, your own sound effects so that's up to you. But anyway we're going to go forward again to when I'm shooting against like here, right here. So we're going to set a keyframe for the for the glow. The foot. We can just rename this as glow. Set a keyframe. Go one frame forward again, just as before. Set it to 100. Now we want to take the mask tool and uh, remask it, uh, because as you can see, it's sliding the wrong area. We have to uh, mask our ha my hand. So uh, press M for our, uh, mask. Press the mask path for both, and uh, yeah, we're just going to set a keyframe here. Go forward again. Uh, sorry, right here, and then just move the masks like that. This looks kind of good. And uh, import another muzzle flash here and set that to add to. Sorry, again. By the way, you rotate by uh, pressing the W uh, button on your keyboard. So, like that. And I guess we have one more. Like right here. Yeah, 
right here. So go to the to the glow layer again, press T, set a keyframe, go one frame forward, set it to one ah sorry, go one frame back here, set it to one hundred, go on one frame back again, and then set it to zero. And go two frame forward and set it to zero, so now it should be the right place. And if you want to move it, you can do all this before, but it seems like it's kind of good still. So, just import a muscle flash more. Um, right here, set it to add. Rotate it if you need to, scale it, whatever. And place it like that. Perfect. You could also make some uh, glow in your face if you want to do that. Um, you can do whatever you want to actually. But um, this looks kind of good. You can see you have this nice smoke here in this area. And same for here. Just set the resolution to full so you can see the details better. Um, yeah, that's kind of good. So uh, this was a very fast tutorial, but. Um, that's anything I have to show you right now. I really hope that you're going to download this package because it's pretty awesome. So, uh, thanks for watching. This was Flag Barrington from Barrington Tutorials.